that in because you want it open. Afraid. Good tasting red boy. Happy yeah, boys, so we here. I know there's one boy RB from Fishing Bar, made us all the way. I ain't gonna I show him one way yet, yet. But I can so show I him a little hook. And I'm gonna put him into the bucket. This is what we call a part. I got about three so far. Call up the Call up the man. No, I'm trying to kill him. Try to cut off your legs. Legging still crawling. Oh. You don't eat this one? Yeah. Just eat that? It's a good beer too. Look at that, I hold my hands, look! Oh my god! Are the tentacles just sticking on? Feels so nasty! Alright, pull her off, pull her off. <laughs> ah, yo. <laughs> There's an old conch shell that was in the sea for a while. Conch shell, man. Blow your conch horn. Boop, boop, boop. No snapper. <laughs> Get you off your hook into the bucket. That's a sweet eating fish there, you know? Yeah, people, so I hear what we want, David. David the archer. Balloon fishing. No life gear fish on. You ready? You ready for the action? This gear fish here, that's me. Needle point fish. Uh. That's David balloon that floating and not there with the life bait on it. Something just attacked the fish around there as well. So he wants to see how far he get the balloon float out. If it floats the bait, does it be better? Or I mean, like, what are the like, bottom fishing with life bait and float fishing? What do you think is the best? The best? I take two for you, sure. I can't throw them bike. Yeah. But you find it, you will more pick up on the bait that float. That floating. Possibility. So the difference between bottom fishing and float fishing, when you fish at the bottom, there's certain types of fish at the bottom that will go and attack it. And at the top, there's another type of fish that will go and attack it. Harsai Cavalis will feed at the bottom and still at the top. Barracudas will feed at the bottom and still they will feed at the top. But float fishing is better because when you got the length of the bottom now with the life bait, so the life bait tend to go and tangle up around the um, the, the the rocks and the plants that on the water and you lost the fish. So it's better to float the line so you can always know where it is and easier to bring the fish. So I get some little punters here. Good bait, man. Good bait.
Yeah, so I got it in my hand here to release it. Hello, home, buddy. <laughs> 